Okay guys, welcome to this video. Um in this video I'm going to show you how to create a cool fade effect in Visual Basic 2008 Express Edition. So you open up a new project and select Windows Form application and change this one to whatever you want. I use fade effect tutorial. That's okay. So now for made the fade uh, forms. So now go right click on fade on the uh, project and add and then add a module. It's actually the same as the um, module in Visual Basic 6.0. So I'm going to change fade effect. Add then public sub. Let's say fade in. Okay, I'm going to use this because you have to paste it in form load and then you get a very, um, yeah, you get a lot of code in here and stuff, so you have no side again. Yeah, never mind. So just do it in a um, module, it's much better and it will cause uh, much less errors. So go back to the um, module and type in in fade effect dim fade as double okay for fade equals this is the this is going to be form load so 0 .0, 0 2 1 1 and then it will increase with 0 0.1 so press enter and it will automatically uh, type in next. Now I'm gonna type in. Um, let's see. Okay, me dot. Oh, sorry. It's form one dot opacity equals fade. Okay, form one dot refresh. Form one dot Right. Oh wait a second, not form one, just threading dot thread dot sleep and then between open and closing parentheses one hundred and that's the code. So let's see, um go back to the form code uh close the start page and type in fade in fade in okay so you see it's nice it nicely fades in um so let's make the fade out it's actually actually the same so i'm going to use it in the same um module so public sub fade out fade out okay then fade as double again for fade equals one not one because we already started um so here it will be um you can see it so one dot one is the end result um so we have to go uh, from one dot one to zero dot zero so one dot one to zero dot zero step and now you think maybe think one dot zero zero dot one but then you're wrong I also had this in a couple of few tests and it was wrong because it doesn't fit in uh, oh wait a second no um, so let's make it normal form 1 dot opacity equals fade form 1 dot refresh oh, oh it's wrong it's a good one I mean threading dot thread dot sleep 100 Okay, so when I press run, it will fade in, but it won't fade out, as you can see. So you have to put a minus in front of it. So that's the big mistake that pe many people make. So when I press and run again, it will nicely fade in, and it will and it won't fade out. <laughs> Let's do it again. Sorry, 
um, yeah, I'm just uh, not. I'm just a little bit sleepy. So you go to the form, and then oh, not menu start. Um, let's see. You go to uh, form, and then closing, and then fade out. Sorry that I forgot that, but you nicely fade in, and it will nicely fade out. So it's pretty easy and pretty cool. So. Um, thanks for watching this tutorial. Feel free to comment, rate, and subscribe. If you want to contact contact me, just uh, co comment this video or PM me. So thanks again, and I'll catch you later.